your only superpower at this point is speed. You can't outspend the competition. You can't outwork the competition. There's no prize for like working hard. There's only <laughs> prizes for working smart. My name is、uh, Nopadon, and I've been doing this whole growth thing, the growth shenanigans,、uh, for、uh, 20 plus years.、Um, I'm a co-founder of a company called Startup Core Strengths. The success that you've had、uh, is come from some customer knowledge that you've had, correct? There's、uh, an unmet need that you saw in the market, and you said the current solutions are either shit or they're over-engineered, they're complicated. I can come in and I can fix this problem, right? But beyond that, this becomes very dangerous.、Uh, it's what I would call the curse of knowledge. Where we think we know, right? And we have endless meetings around the table where we say, "Well, I think," and the engineers and the product people say, "I think," and it should be, and whatever. And it's a waste of time. It's a waste of time and energy. And so the first sort of port of call for all of you is、uh, customer conversations and really to adopt a test and learn methodology. This is why I was asking how many of you actually are running. Weekly experiments, sprints, right? So the first thing is, we don't know. We have a hypothesis. We have certain assumptions, right? And what we have to do is be able to de-risk those things as quickly as possible. You have a superpower, and that superpower is speed. And you should be utilizing that speed to your advantage. And the only way to do that is. Every single person on the team is aligned, and is aligned, and knows exactly the thing that they're working on is going to contribute to that thing that matters most right now. Decide as a team on your north star metric. Ad- identify your key growth levers. Identify your bottlenecks and begin just like your engineering team does, working through sprints. But this is like experiment and marketing sprints. To unlock that knowledge, unlock those wins. It is extremely simple, guys. Really is. It really is. It's not hard whatsoever. But you just have to have that discipline in order to do it. And that's how you grow. I swear to God. <music> Growth is everyone's job, and it's inc- and it's incredibly important. For the team to be extremely focused and aligned around the things that matter most and what has to be done, the barriers that I see time and time again is、uh, multiple priorities, doing too much, doing unimportant things,、um, not having a test and learn methodology, just sort of like winging it,、um, and not knowing your customers to the level that you need to. So. All of us have built products. All of us have businesses, and we know of our customers' pain, so we know enough. But we know enough to be dangerous. And so, what I challenge you guys to do, what teams need to do, is dig deeper to really find those insights,、um, really understand, as we mentioned, the, your prospects' outcomes, their anxieties, the things that cause them inertia,、uh, and that ruthless sort of prioritization that teams need to. Do in order to focus and grow. If you have co-founders who are on a different page, how are you possibly going to grow in the most efficient, methodical fashion, right? And so,、uh, once you get beyond two founders or your founding team, and you have a larger team, there is this opportunity for people to just move and work in different directions. And as I mentioned to you guys earlier, your only superpower at this point is speed. You can't outspend the competition. You can't outwork the competition. There's no prize for like working hard. There's only <laughs> prizes for working smart. And the only way you guys can do this is by getting through those validated learning loops as quick as possible. 
And so test and learn and be uh, focused, extremely focused on uh, your North Star.